Hey y'all, it's Hunter Petty John, and I am starting a podcast. I know, right? How original. Well, uh, I'm just letting you guys know that this podcast is going to be called Relation Shipping and Handling. Yeah, I don't even know why I'm trying to announce this to you. I mean, if you're watching this or listening to it, you probably clicked on something that already gave you that in the title. But here we are. Now, I'm sure you can tell by the title that I'm going to be diving into things that have to do with relationships and how to handle the different aspects of those relationships. And I'm going to do that because, well, let's face it, I'm an expert when it comes to relationships. If you don't believe me, ask my girlfriend or my best friend Richard or my family or anybody I go to church with and they'll tell you that you're probably right not to believe me because I'm really not good at a lot of things whenever it comes to relationships. And in fact, some things I just downright suck at. So this isn't gonna be me teaching you anything or preaching at you. Um, It really what it's gonna be is I'm trying to figure out how to be better at these different relationships and these different things that come along with, with relationships. Anything from relationships with God to strangers, to family members, to romantic relationships, anything in between. So really, this is just going to be a journey that I'd love for y'all to be a part of. So this podcast is actually going to be centered around some core scriptures. And it takes place in the book of Matthew, chapter 22, verses 37 through 40. Okay, the picture is that Jesus is preaching and teaching. Definitely not what I'm going to be doing. But these Pharisees or religious people come up and they're trying to ask him this question that's really meant to just throw him off, okay? And they ask him this question of, okay, Jesus, what is the greatest commandment, right? So they're asking, what's the one thing that's the greatest out of all these 613 commandments? And I really hope I did my research and got that correct, I'm pretty sure that's the right number. If not, please, somebody let me know. Um, I'm sorry if it's not. But the point is, they ask this question, right? And so we pick up in verse 37. Jesus replies, Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. For this is the first and greatest commandment. And the second is like it. Love your neighbors as yourself. For the law and prophets all hang on these commandments. So basically he's saying really what it comes all down to is love God, love others, right? Have a relationship with God and have a relationship with others. Now this just goes to solidify this belief that I feel like the Holy Spirit has really encapsulated in me over the last year or so. And that is that our purpose on earth, we have three things that we're supposed to do. Our purpose are these three things. Love God, love others, and spread the gospel, right? And I really want to be better at loving God and loving others, building a better relationship with God and building better relationship with others. And if I do that, I do believe that spreading the gospel will just be an outflow of of who I am. And so I would love for y'all to just join me weekly as I dive into different relationships and the different challenges or aspects that might be a little tricky in those relationships and just grow with me, right? It's for the most part, it's just going to be me. Every once in a while, I'm going to have a guest on because, well, I don't know a lot about a lot of different things. So um, in a couple of weeks, I'm going to have Jasmine join me, my beautiful, wonderful girlfriend, because, well, she probably knows more about some of the stuff that we're going to be talking about that week than me. (laughs) In fact, I know she does. Another thing is I would love for this to be interactive. So subscribe, friend, whatever. You guys know the drill. But leave me comments, message me. I'll leave you guys my email. And let me know um, if this is impacting you, if it's a blessing, if it's an encouragement. 
um, what I could do better, uh, what you like, those kind of things. But also, if you have an idea of something that I could do, would be great. I would love to do that. And if I mess up, if I misinterpret something, please correct me. I want I want correction if I'm doing something wrong. But please do it in love and gentleness because that's what God calls us to do. So if you're interested, I hope to see you guys in about a week or so with my first episode. So be on the lookout. And until then, I'll see you later.